Right now I just want an orange pop and a caramel. <laughs> Good morning everyone, welcome to the Sunday Shave. Uh, this week, new soap to me. Uh, it's not really new, okay, well, you, you have seen the soap uh, lately more and more. Soap by Wild West Shaving Company. The soap is Wichita. Soap itself, okay, comes in a two ounce tub. Um, okay, soap, if you look at it, it's kind of pink. It's really soft, really soft soap. Uh, scent on it, well, the scent on it, you can smell the rose right off the bat when it's in the tub. Then there is a little bit, a little background of vetiver and coffee. Uh, there's a little darkness there. Uh, okay, the, the description of the, the scent is bay rum, vetiver, wood smoke, coffee, and rose. Well, it's kind of the it's kind of backward, really. You smell it; the rose comes right up front. Coffee vetiver, wood smoke. There's probably something, but it's more when you're gonna lather the soap that you will. That there's gonna be a little smokiness to it, and the bay rum will come out just a little bit when you lather it. I'm not a big fan of rose scented soaps, but this one, okay, it's a uh, there's another one I like, okay, it's uh, La Rose de Pouchkar from Le Père Lucien. Well, this one, it's my number two. It's wonderful. It's a really, it's really nice twist on the rose. It's not, it's not a feminine rose. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful scent. Um, in past two, I'll explain why I really like this one. Now, uh, with this, we're gonna go with the brush, uh, Razor Rock Monster, okay, plus of not, synthetic, very nice brush. The razor, I'm gonna use the Rockwell 6S this week. Uh, the plate, plate number four, uh, the blade in it, okay, blade Sagan use, it's a Gillette 7 o'clock super stainless. First use was yesterday for the French video. Now, as the soap is in a small tub like that, I'm a face ladder, okay? I'm, I'm gonna use a shaving bowl today, but the bowl will be to load the brush and not to build the ladder. Pretty simple, like you see, there's a little bit that's gone. Take a spoon, let's take a little bit out. Okay, that might be too much really, but I prefer having too much than not enough. Just go squish it in the bowl. There you go, squish in the bowl. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go wet the face, load the brush, then I come back to you for the first pass, okay? Give me a sec. Okay, the brush is loaded. Um, if you look at the bowl right now, okay, there's a little bit of ladder left in it. The event that I run out, I'll go back, but I shouldn't, okay, it's quite, it's quite there. It's, uh, just quite full there. Okay, first application. Now the brush is fairly dry. As I didn't want to build the ladder in the, uh, in the bowl. And yesterday, yesterday in the French video too, uh, I went kind of dry with the ladder. And uh, actually, it was kind of a mistake. In third pass, I went and I loaded up the. Uh, I did hydrate it more, and the ladder was really, really, really nice, creamy, super slick. Um, it doesn't take a lot of water to do a nice ladder, but the soap, the, the soap can deal with water 
uh, very well. Okay, we're just gonna we're gonna go for something pretty wet today. Okay, stand strength on that. Um, it's a seven. The rose, the rose is going. Okay, the rose is toned down when you start blattering. Uh, there's more of the darkness of the coffee, the vetiver that's coming out. Somewhere in the background, there's a little bit of spiciness from the bay rum also. It's pretty creamy, it's pretty thick. I'm not gonna over hydrate it just yet. We're gonna keep that for the third pass. Okay, uh, 24 hours grow, first pass with the grain. The success you guys saw last two videos, I was using the curve. <sighs> On AP, the curve is kind of winning the contest right now. I'm getting closer shave faster with the curve, and the curve is smoother. Anyway, the soap, uh, there's some residual slickness in the back, not a huge lot. The soap is tallow based, uh, that's probably why it works so well with water. Scent is very nice. Okay, residual slickness, it's not, it's probably not the top soap for that, but um, it, while, the, while the ladder is there, there's absolutely zero problem, it's great. It's a very stable ladder. Okay, it's one of those ladder that even if you think that you over hydrated it, it's easy to uh, the ladder the soap is dealing with water very well it's hard to make mistake with it okay and a first pass there we go um, it, there's still a little bit of residual sickness like I said okay it's not the one that has the most it's there okay face protected it's Glides very well. Um, well, the razor, I don't know, okay. Uh, it's not giving me exactly what I want. We're still gonna reach a decent shape with it, but it's not like that new razor I got. I'm gonna go rinse the face, we're gonna come back for pass number two, okay? Give me a sec. Okay, pass number two. Like I said, it's it's a scent I really like. Um, funnily enough, it reminds me going skidoing with my dad. Uh, when I was young, we used to go skidoing. I was five, six years old, go skidoing. Then during the ride, my dad would it would stop at the tavern, okay, the tavern, <laughs> everybody stopped there skidooing for a beer, 
And uh, back then, well, Tavern had absolutely zero problem <laughs> bringing kids in. Would go inside the tavern, then Dad would buy me an orange pop and a caramel, sit at the bar, and and all the kids were all sitting at the bar, all of them. The, the fathers were sitting on tables, but the reason why is when you were sitting at the table, you were looking at the bartender. Well, in the back, there was dancers and not ballet dancers. Okay, if you get them, if you get it. Well, in between gigs, the ladies would come and sit at the bar with the kids. I don't know. And they had that kind of rose perfume there. I like it. Okay, second pass. Okay, we're gonna go across the grain. Super nice shave. Again, the soap has super nice fragrance. Uh, the wetter the soap get, the more residual slickness there is. third pass I'm gonna try to hydrate it a little more see what we can get done with it okay end up second pass uh, it's getting better now uh, but I do need I do need the uh, against the grain pass okay I'm gonna go rinse the face come back for pass number three okay give me a sec okay your face is super wet Okay, it doesn't look, it doesn't look uh, the best ladder, but just, okay, just by painting my face with the brush, okay, I can't, I can't feel the, I can't feel the tip of the, um, of the brush. I know it's slick. There we go. I probably could squeeze the stuff off the brush and use that, but pointless. Okay, third pass against the grain. Yeah, like I said, the
the razor, I don't know. Um, I got, okay, I got a few things coming for the next few weeks. Um, first, I'm getting an aristocrat from uh, Razor Emporium. We're going to see that at some point. Okay, aristocrat that was remade. Uh, I'll talk a little bit about the process, not at the end. Uh, not at the Razor Emporium end because, well, they do have videos explaining what they do, but more the experience as the customer, okay, when you buy okay, a razor that you want to be redone. And actually, I didn't supply the razor, okay, I just, I guess it's, it's called made to order. Anyway, I got one of those coming. I also got uh, the curve razor. I got another one coming. The three and a half, three and a half inch handle and the D plate. I also got an A plate coming with that. Uh, when I get it, I talk about the reason why I reorder it. I reordered another one. Since it's the second one, I probably like it a lot. Eh? Okay. Nah. Eh. Actually, I'm just gonna. Second day in a row now. Same thing, same thing happened yesterday. I had to go and touch up. Okay, done. Done. Okay, end of third pass, and we're done, okay? Uh, pretty decent shave, although the razor didn't exactly perform the way I wanted. Uh, it's still, okay, couple touch-ups, okay, good shave, uh, it's right there. Uh, the soap performance, well, number one, okay? There's absolutely nothing to complain about. Great scent, uh, the rose scent, I love it. What I like from their from the soap, uh, from the Wild, uh, Wild West Shaving Co. The scents are different, okay? We finally got an artisan that came out of what is done and we're coming, he's coming up with really, really, really good scents that are different and the soap is a really good performer. Anyway, I'm gonna go rinse the face for one last time then I'm gonna come back with the conclusion, okay? Just give me a minute. Okay, the face is rinse. Um, I didn't use the Allen block today. There we go. Um, I'm not going to use Tayers either. The aftershave I'm going to use, it's going to be a little bit different. Okay, um, it has nothing to do with roses. What I'm going to use is Ogallala Bay Rum, Bay Rum and uh, Vanilla. Um, it's it has nothing to do with that, the scent of the uh, the soul, but I'm just in a bay rum phase now. It's month of March, we have had snow, it's funny here in Halifax, it has, it has been snowing more in March and it has been the whole winter. Uh, so I need something warm. Uh, 
the Ogallala uh, Bay Rum. This one <laughs> smells like burnt marshmallows. It's really nice. <laughs> Feel like licking my face. Uh, <laughs> Okay, nice scent. Uh, like the other Bay Rums, okay, it's, there is a little bit of a burn. It's not a huge burn, but it, it comes in very slowly, then increase, then slows down. It's nice burn. It's really nice after shave. I really like it. Anyway, that completes the shave for today. Okay, the soap we reviewed was uh, Wild Wish Shaving Co. Wichita. Beautiful, beautiful rose scented smell. Uh, I really liked it. Uh, the brush, look at that, didn't clean it. Okay, it's the Razor Rock Monster Plissoff, Plissoff Nut, okay, synthetic brush. Razor, the Rockwell 6S, okay, plate number four with a blade. It was a uh, second day, second shave on it. Gillette 7 o'clock super stainless and finally we finish with Ogallala Bay Rum uh, Bay Rum Vanilla with this I hope you guys enjoyed the shave today I hope you guys are gonna have tons of good shave this week uh, and I hope to see you next weekend okay for another shave video something I don't know yet but I'm sure we're gonna find something interesting with this have good shaves have a good week Bye.